let me check the box here. Here's the box that came in. It's a rated at 4,000 peak watts, um, 3,300 running watts. So it came packed very nice. I can't say a problem there. It was no damage, whatever. It came with uh, a few tools to use and stuff like that. But um, I'm fixing to start it up here for the first time. But um, what I did was I put the oil in it per the manufacturer's recommendations. Um, removed the shipping braces and the various things that came in there. This generator really had some good reviews and one of the things I read about it was it said a lot of people after you know five or ten hours of use started having problems and they found out it was the spark plug so what I did was I went down and got a new spark plug for it as you can see it's it's right in there that's the spark plug so I took the spark plug out took it down to AutoZone replaced it with an AC Delco plug I would say about my only complaint so far is, is that to change the plug you have to take the gas tank up to get to it so um, um, that's really it I've got the unit set to on the fuel valve on there and it says to got the choke on and it says to pull to a resistance on the engine then let it go back so let's see what I can do here Cranking in that cylinder. Alright, I'm going to give it a crank. Let's see how it works. Okay. It's trying to. Let's try to choke it, maybe a little back. Choked a little too much, so I put the choke on half choke. Uh, there it is right there, no choke. Runs pretty good. So far I can't see uh, anything I'm surprised at really how quiet it is so far for an external generator, so I'm going to let it run here for a little while and see how it does and check back in. Alright? Check y'all later. Bye.